The demolition of the Kuge market in Bukuru area of just south local government of Plateau State affected traders have appealed to the state government to provide an alternative space for them to continue their businesses. The demolition was said to be due to the proximity of some shops to railway lines as well as others that are built on the railway lines. Dixon Adama, who spoke to some of the victims, said the state government will soon commence the intra-city rail transport system, which requires the railway channels to be cleared. His report is presented from our studio. Demolition of the market has the slot traders who are estimated to be over 3,000. The affected traders are calling on the government to assist them with any form of financial empowerment or palliative to cushion the effect of the demolition as they incurred varying degrees of losses due to the incident. Speaking on the ordeal of the people on Wednesday, the chairman of the Elders Forum in the area, Danlami Garba, said although they are not challenging the state government in the exercise, they are, however, begging Governor Caleb Muthwang to provide an alternative to the people or at least compensate those who have lost their means of livelihood to the exercise. The government now should come to their aid with some palliatives and uh, if need be some of them should be given an assistance because many of them lost their property and uh, it is only the government now can assist because we don't have pro um, the loan trophies that uh, will now say okay let us come and uh, assist the, the, the the, 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 the we are calling government to look at this issue, to find a way to help our members, because this thing are, has put people into competition. They don't know where to go and do their markets. What my farm and the left this place when we we used to stay and find something to eat with our children and now we don't know where to stay. We want government to find a way that we so that we can be staying there and find something to eat with our children. On behalf of the widows and the orphans and the less privileged in this market, that the government should please help us and look for a place for us. Now everybody is stranded, rain will soon start falling now, we don't know where to go. Look at me now, I am doing POS, I have saloon, I sell snacks but no place, I am just working with my bag to see if I can get something that will take home for my children. Although victims of the demolition exercise are appealing to the government for assistance to enable recover and continue their businesses, it is believed that this is not the last of such exercise as other decongested places along train lines and the intracity buses lanes would be cleared.